The Violin Concerto in D, Opus 35 of Tchaikovsky, dating to 1878. We heard a performance by violinist Pinka Zuckerman and the Israel Philharmonic, directed by Zubin Mehta. And we play that for Sam Basamonte. That brings us to the close of this segment of Homespun, Dee Yaffe's Marathon Request Program for the Holy Week Holidays. Thanks for joining me, Tiffany. Do stay on, as we are far from done for today. The afternoon will be taken up by Richard Wagner's iconic Tristan und Isolde, and Julia will be your host. DCFE is non-commercial, non-profit, and completely donor-supported. If you enjoy our music and appreciate what we do, there are several ways to give the station much-needed help. Prayer is certainly one, and there is giving. Support information is available on our website, at dcfe.febc.ph. Enjoy the rest of Homespun, and take care. Fight the advance of COVID-19. Here is how to remove a mask. Take it off from behind, making sure not to touch the front of the mask. Discard the mask immediately in a closed bin. Clean your hands with soap and water or alcohol. Learn more from the World Health Organization online at who.int. This is the generous grace of our Lord Jesus Christ. Though he was rich, yet for your sakes he became poor, so that by his poverty he could make you rich. He humbled himself, that sinners in him might be exalted. The season of the cross and resurrection on 98.7 DZFE. DZFE, presenting Masters of Lasting Music and the Master of Everlasting Life. Hi there, this is Julia joining you on Homespun's second segment, dedicated to Richard Wagner's opera Tristan und Isolde. As a special treat, we have soprano Joanna Goh, host of DZFE's Opera File, which aired from 2010 to 2016, to guide us through the work. She has kindly given permission to reprise her Opera File programs on Tristan und Isolde, which, in the interest of time, we will slightly abridge and combine for this afternoon's Homespun feature. As longtime listeners of DZFE know, Joanna talks through excerpts before each act, and then plays through the entire act afterwards. We do hope you'll enjoy her presentation. The performers we will hear are Helga Dernesch as Isolde, John Vickers as Tristan, Krista Ludwig as Brangena, Walter Berry as Corvinal, Peter Schreier as the Young Sailor, and the Berlin Philharmonic in the Berlin State Opera House Chorus, all under Herbert von Karajan. Without further ado, here is Joanna Goss' opera file presentation of Richard Wagner's Tristan und Isolde. This goes out to our homespun requester, Roel Badwa. A pleasant evening to you all, and welcome to Opera File. I am your host, Joanna. Continuing on with our theme of celebrated couples in opera, we turn our attentions tonight to, in my opinion, the most famous pairing in the history of opera, Tristan und Isolde. As this monumental work by Richard Wagner is four hours long, I have decided to split it, the first part tonight and the concluding part next Saturday. I know that seems a torturously long time to find out the fate of this couple, but as unfulfilled longing is one of the main themes of this work, Perhaps the interim of one week will teach us something of such longing.
Mellow 94.7. Sounds, Sounds good. good. All hits. Mellow 94.7. Sounds good. All hits. Mellow 94.7. Sounds good. All hits. 94.7. Mellow 94.7. Sounds good. Whoa. All hits. Mellow 94.7. Sounds good. Kanyang pag-ibig sa atin nang isugo niya sa mundo ang kanyang kaisa-isang anak upang magkaroon tayo ng buhay sa pamamagitan niya. Ang 93.9 IFM ay kaisa ng sambayan ng Pilipino sa paggunita ng mahal na araw. Kung ako ang tatanong ano ang radyo mo? Ang sagot ko ay FM Ang best friend kong FM Ang sarap makinig araw-gabi Best friend din niya ko kasi Kaya ang radyo ko ay FM Ang best friend kong FM ay FM 90 1059 Neo Retro The One Neo Retro 1059 wants you to be vigilant and mindful in the face of the coronavirus pandemic. With neither cure nor vaccine in sight, here are some practical things you should know and must do to manage the situation. For errands that require leaving the home, like going to the market, wear face masks and bring sanitizers at all times. Some practical things you should know and must do in coping with the COVID-19 pandemic. From Neo Retro 1059, The One. In the observance of Holy Week, Neo Retro 1059 will sign off on Holy Thursday at 11.59 p.m. and will be back on air at 5 a.m. on Easter Sunday, April 12, 2020. Would like everyone to take this time to pray and remember the passion of Christ. 1059 Neo Retro The One 1059 Neo Retro The One Ang salita ng Diyos mula naman sa pangalawang kronika at kung ang aking bayan na tinatawag sa pamamagitan ng aking pangalan ay magpakumbaba at manalangin at hanapin ako at tumakikot sa kanilang masasamang lakad akin silang papakinggan mula sa langit at patpatawarin ko ang kanilang kasalanan at pagagalingin ko ang kanilang lupain. Naway sabayan ninyo ako sa panalangin na ito. Panalangin laban sa pandemya ng COVID-19. Ikaw lamang o Diyos, ang aming kanlungan, ang aming muog at panangga, laban sa mapagpinsalang sakit ng COVID-19 na kumakalat sa aming bayan. Patawarin mo po kami sa lahat ng aming mga kasalanan at kasamaan, sa aming kayabangan at kahambugan na amin ngayon'y pinagsisisihan at tinatakwil. Nagpapakumbaba kami at kumikilala na ikaw ang Diyos na banal at makatarungan. 
ngunit ikaw rin ang Diyos na mahabagin at mapagbiyaya na nagpapatawad sa aming mga kasalanan. Inihiling po namin na iyong puksain ang salot ng COVID-19 na nananalanta sa aming bayan. Pagalingin mo po ang mga may sakit at mga nahawaan ng sakit na ito at iligtas mo po sila sa kamatayan. Kahabagan mo rin ang aming mga manggagawang medikal na nagbubuwis ng kanilang lakas at buhay sa paglilingkod sa mga may sakit. Pagkalooban mo po ng dunong at karunungan, kalakasan at tibay ng loob, ang aming pamahalaan at mga pamunuan sa tamang pamamahala at paglutas sa mga hamon ng pandemyang ito. Bigyan mo rin po ng dunong at galing ang aming mga dalabhasang mananiliksig sa pagdiskubre ng tamang bakuna at panggamot sa sakit na dulot ng COVID-19. Salamat na dahil sa salot na ito, ay eh lalo naming napagyayaman ang aming mga pamilya, natutuwid ang aming mga maling prioridad at pagpapahalaga, nasasaway ang aming mga maling gawi, at napapakumbaba at napapalapit kami sa iyo na tanging Diyos at manggiligtas namin. Turuan mo kaming sumunod sa iyong mga salita, at patuloy na tumalikod sa lahat ng uri ng kasalanan, kahabagan mo po kami at dingin mo ang aming dalangin. At kami ay buong pusong nagpapasalamat sa iyong kabutihan sa pagtugon sa aming pagsamo na ito. Sa pangalan ng iyong anak na si Jesus, na aming kinikilala bilang aming tanging tagapagligtas at Panginoon. Amen. 1059 Neo Retro The One That song was brought to you by Price Gas. Now accessible to all PLDT landlines nationwide. Sun, Smart, and Talk and Text subscribers. For Globe and TM subscribers, call 0966-564-2423. Up to 26. The effective, fervent prayer of a righteous man. Available much. James 5, 16b. Whoops, teka lang. Anong estasyon nga yung napakinggan mo sa restaurant? <laughs> In the meantime, magdo-double time kami. Do sa tinatawag ninyo, middle class. How is it defined or arrived at correctly? We'll talk about this. 91.5 Win Radio Radio The coronavirus disease is a new sickness that is highly contagious and should not be taken lightly. To combat the threat of COVID-19, it's always best to be prepared. So, here are a couple of reminders for everyone to keep in mind. Always wash your hands with soap and water. Make it a habit. Use alcohol and hand sanitizer. Keep them handy all the time. Cover your mouth with a handkerchief or tissue whenever you cough or sneeze. Dispose of the tissue properly after. Avoid close contact with a person who has fever or shows symptoms of the flu. Make sure that food is thoroughly cooked, especially meat and eggs. Avoid direct contact with live animals and surfaces in contact with animals without any protection. And most importantly, wear a face mask. In any situation, always be prepared. Remember, you can help prevent the spread of the virus. Basta't laging handa at sama-sama, kaya natin to. Brought to you by the PCOO, DOH, KBP, and this station. In any need. Luzon Enhanced Community Quarantine. Sa mga papasok at lalabas ng Pilipinas, papayagang makapasok ng bansa ang mga Pilipino, pati ang anak at asawang foreigner nito. Ang mga galing China, Hong Kong at Macau ay isa sa ilalim sa 14-day quarantine. Ang mga dumating from abroad ay dapat mag-undergo ng 14-day mandatory home quarantine. Papayagang umalis ang mga OFW, balikbayan o foreign nationals pero dapat within 24 hours mula nang umalis sila sa kanilang pinanggalingan ang schedule ng flight. Hindi allowed lumabas ng bansa ang mga magbabiyahe bilang mga turista sa alinmang destinasyon. Pinagbabawal ang maraming maghahatid sa mga paalis na biyahero. Isang paalala mula sa PCOO, DOH. 
KBP at nang himpilang ito. In 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 in. COVID-19. Reminders from DOH. Tamang paggamit ng mask. Makakatulong ang pagsuot ng surgical mask para maiwasan ang paggalat ng mga viruses na nagdudulot ng nakakahawang sakit tulad ng COVID-19. At para ito ay maging epektibo, narito ang tamang paraan ng paggamit nito. Una, hawakan ng mask sa strap at siguraduhin na tatakpan nito ang bibig at ilong. Tandaan na ang white side ng mask ang nasa loob at ang blue o ang may kulay na side ang nasa labas. Sunod ay imolde ang nose piece ayon sa hugis ng iyong ilong. Sa paghubad ng face mask, sa strap ito hawakan at saka itapon sa tamang basurahan. Huwag kalimutan na maghugas ng kamay gamit ang sabon at tubig. Basta't laging handa at sama-sama, kaya natin to. Isang mahalagang paalala mula sa DOH, PCOO, KBB at nanghimpilang ito. Jesus lived among us so we can learn the ways of the Father. He gave up His life so that we may live as He has taught us. This Holy Week, 91.5, Win Radio joins the Christian nation as we reflect on the Passion of Christ. for our Easter special. Oh, yes, I got a lot of living to do. Elvis and Beatles all day long versus COVID-19 blues. Uplift your spirit on Easter Sunday, April 12, and listen to RJFM 100.3 all day long. We can work it out. For years, we've had Elvis versus Beatles. Now, Elvis and the Beatles join hands and fight the COVID-19 coronavirus by strengthening your immune system and giving you a musical break. So Elvis and Beatles fans all over the Philippines, get ready for Elvis and Beatles against coronavirus blues. Sunday, April 12, all day long. Happy Easter, everybody. RJFM 100.3, your life in music. 100.3, RJFM. Thank you very much, and good night. Good afternoon, and welcome to the second hour. It's a Monday Thursday. You're on RJFM 100.3. Sammy Smith would help me make it through the night. Starting off this set and starting off the hour, written and composed by Chris Christofferson, also recorded by Chris for his 1970 album, simply titled Christofferson. But it's actually this version, the version by Sammy Smith, that is the most well-known version of the track. And it was followed by the one, the only, Barbara Streisand, the love theme of her 1971 movie, opposite Chris Christopherson, A Star is Born, Evergreen. And last Sunday, she praised Taiwan for its handling of the coronavirus outbreak. In a tweet, Barbara wrote that despite its close proximity to China and frequent flights from Wuhan, Taiwan has managed the worst of the COVID-19 pandemic. She pointed out that as of that day, Taiwan had only 350 confirmed cases and five deaths and that most schools and businesses remained open. So that was a tweet posted by Barbara Streisand last Sunday. And the song we just listened to, Over the Rainbow, from Eric Clapton. And a little piece of history today, April 9, back in 1965, the Beatles' Ticket to Ride was released in the United Kingdom. Happened today, back in 1965. And coming your way this hour, the music of the Carpenters, David Foster. We have Mamas and the Papas, Bette Midler, and Elton John. This is RJFM 100.3. Sa lahat ng mga magigiting nating mga kababayan sa frontline. Pacheck po ng inyong ID. Inyong malalim po. Lagi po tayong maguhugas ng kamay, ha? Check po tayo ng temperature. Kayo ang aming mga bayani. Maraming maraming salamat po sa inyong serbisyo. 
lahat kami ay saludo at sumusuporta sa inyo. Atid sa inyo ng PCOO, DOH, KBP at ng ipilang ito. Here at RJFM 100.3, we want you to be happy. That's why our main man RJ recorded this classic in 2016 from his romancing album. Here's Smile. That was Smile from RJ's Romancing Album. Available at RJ Guitar Center, Bistro RJ. Listen online on Spotify or order at lazada.com.ph. company with great music the greatest and the latest on a Monday Thursday got Ryan here and we started this set with the mamas and the papas with got a feeling a song is also recorded by the temptations back in 1964 and odd is ready in 1965 it was followed by boss Kags with look what you've done to me from the urban cowboy soundtrack of course the movie that starred John Travolta and Deborah Winger released back in 1980 produced by David Foster and this is such a star-studded track Besides David Foster as a producer, Don Henley and Glenn Frey of the Eagles also did backup vocals. And speaking of David Foster, the song we just listened to along with Kenny G, the love theme from St. Elmo's Fire. From the soundtrack of the movie released back in 1985 and this track also comes in two versions. The instrumental one, like the one we just heard, and the duet version that features the vocals of Amy Holland and Donna Gerald, and also titled Just for a Moment. That was Kenny G with David Foster with a love theme from St. Elmo's Fire. And if you happen to be celebrating your birthday today, the 9th of April, happy birthday to you. Today happens to be the birthday of actress Cynthia Nixon, who played Miranda in Sex in the City. She was born today back in 1966. And speaking of Sex in the City, the ladies of SATC, yep, SATC, have reunited in a podcast to thank the healthcare workers, especially that of New York City. NYC, if you're a big fan of Sex in the City, was the center, the center location of their very successful TV show. So we got a lot more great music coming your way only here on RJFM 100.3. The COVID-19 pandemic is starting to overwhelm our hospitals and healthcare systems. At the same time, people with legitimate healthcare needs either cannot be accommodated at this time or face the risk of contracting the virus. For friends who need to have their breast consultations, the Asian Breast Center is an ambulatory breast care facility that serves as a one-stop shop for all your breast care needs, including molecular breast imaging and intraoperative radiation therapy. All of this can take place within the day and often do not require admission, thereby reducing your exposure to infectious diseases such as COVID-19. ABC is located on the 8th floor of Centuria Medical Makati, the country's largest and most comprehensive outpatient medical facility. Call 09171-BREAST to make an appointment. RJFM presents... Joe and Mike Chan with their new original song From Now On From Now On a brand new original song from Joe and Mike Chan available on Spotify iTunes and at your nearby friendly Starbucks The greatest hits of all time The BBC in London, going direct to Raja Broadcasting Network. RJ 100 FM in Manila and throughout the Philippines. Hello, I'm Tom Watts with the BBC News. Italy's Prime Minister Giuseppe Conte has told the BBC that the European Union might collapse as a project unless it acts decisively to help countries worst hit by the coronavirus outbreak. There are grandes sfide. It's a big challenge to the existence of Europe and to the history of Europe. We're not just writing pages in the books of economics, we're writing pages in history books. Myself and other European leaders need to rise to the challenge. And there's no doubt that if our response isn't strong and unified, if Europe fails to come up with a monetary and financial policy adequate for the biggest challenge since the Second World War, for sure not only Italians but European citizens will be deeply disappointed. 
Italy is pushing for a coordinated economic response from the bloc by allowing countries to share debt. But the proposal is opposed by Germany and the Netherlands, causing a rise in anti-European sentiment in Italy. The head of the World Health Organization has urged unity and global solidarity to fight the coronavirus outbreak as the agency comes under sustained attack from President Trump. Dr. Tedros Adhanom Ghebreyesus called for an end to the politicization of COVID-19. David Willis has more details. Facing growing criticism over his handling of the crisis, President Trump is now seeking to pin the blame for the spread of the coronavirus on the World Health Organization, which he accused of being biased towards China. He's calling for an investigation into the Geneva-based UN agency and is threatening to withhold millions of dollars in U.S. funding. Officials at the WHO criticized the Trump administration's decision to impose a ban on travelers from China at the end of January calling the move unnecessary. The United States is continuing to reel under the coronavirus pandemic, with Wednesday seeing 1,973 deaths, the highest daily total so far. New York State suffered its biggest death toll yet, with 779 succumbing to the virus. Charles Haviland reports. Every number is a face. That was the remark of the New York State Governor Andrew Cuomo. Lamenting that society is currently unable to protect its most weak, he is having flags flown at half-mast across the state. Even veteran doctors and nurses are reported to be shocked at the speed of deterioration and death in so many. Medics themselves are highly vulnerable, and coronavirus-related deaths across the U.S. have exceeded 14,500. The shortage of tests for the virus continues to be much criticized. A unilateral ceasefire by the Saudi-led coalition in Yemen is due to take effect within a few hours. The coalition, which has been fighting against the Iranian-backed Houthi rebels who control the capital, says it'll halt operations for at least two weeks. World News from the BBC. The BBC World News, heard live nationwide on RJFM. The BBC and the Raja Broadcasting Network, media partners in news and public affairs. Broadcasting live from the heart of metropolitan Manila. Moving with you through the changing times. Bringing you your music. Connecting generations. This is RJFM. 96.5 in Tugigarao. 91.1 in Baguio. 99.9 in Palawan. 99.9 in Bacolod. 98.3 in Iloilo. 88.7 in Iligan. 88.5 Cagayan de Oro. 100.3 in Cebu, Davao, and Metro Manila. And around the world on www.rjplanet.com. Live the soundtracks of your life through five decades of music. This is the Raja Broadcasting Network, playing nothing but the greatest and the latest. RJ FM 100.3. We play what we want on RJ FM. Playing the soundtrack of your life. RJ FM 100.3.